Hey, what's up dudes? Your boy J Buck is back with another movie review and it's Christmas time. It's Christmas time. I love Christmas time. Christmas trees, Christmas presents, holidays, just all of the Christmas stuff is the best. So since it's Christmas time, I thought it'd be appropriate to, 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 to review one of the best Christmas movies out there right now, Die Hard, featuring Bruce Willis as John McClane, Nakatomi Plaza. Like this movie is awesome and it's got some of the best christmas milestones in it like there's family there's a christmas party there's christmas spirit there's terrorists there's murder okay maybe not those last two so should die hard be everyone's go-to christmas movie hey <laughs> let's find out so die hard follows like this new york cop you mean you like, other people's lunches cop. stop it John McClane and he's going to like California anyways like Bruce Willis is maybe one of the best movie stars we have right now like this guy is so good in this performance like mark my words this guy will never phone in a performance Anyways, he shows up in California to his wife's work, Nakatomi Plaza. There's a Christmas party. This plaza plays a huge role in this movie. Anyways, he's trying to reconnect with his wife, and then ba 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 ba. There's machine guns everywhere. Ah! People are screaming. Terrorist has taken over the plaza. There's hostages, and John McClane. John McClane has to save the day. Die Hard is action packed. Like this movie is straight up 80. He's going to play a wonderful game called Who is My Daddy? And what does he do? Awesomeness. There's tons of action like these these terrorist guys. They're trying to hunt down John McClane, but he's taking them out one by one by one. McClane takes out this one dude and the rights on his sweater. Now I have a machine gun. Ho, ho, ho. Dude, that is so, that is so badass. But yeah, there are so many shootouts from McClane, the terrorists, the cops. Like this, this is an action-packed 80s movie. And besides the action, this is a pretty tense movie. Like, McClane has to, like, sneak around from these terrorists, and he's, like, hiding in vents. He's hanging from the side of the plaza, and he's, like, shimmying down elevator shafts. Hehe, <laughs> shafts. Like, some moments, I didn't even know if McClane was gonna make it out alive. Like, John! There's this one part where he runs across all of this glass and his feet are bleeding. Like, I was, I didn't know if he was gonna make it. Wait a minute, couldn't the terrorists have just followed his blood trail? Willis also has some hilarious, badass lines in Die Hard. Like, he gets called a cowboy by one of the terrorists, and he's just like, yippee ki mother he says it with so much sass. And then Carl Winslow, yeah, Carl Winslow, the police officer from Family Matters is in this movie. I'll, I'll get into that later, but when he shows up, then Bruce Willis is like, Welcome to the party, pal! And it's so slick, and the thing is, I want them to make like two, three, four, five of these Die Hard movies because this is an action-packed franchise. It will never, this is a great franchise. And John McClane, Bruce Willis, Bruce Willis turns in a, this guy will never, and I say it again, they will never, Phone in a performance. Also, like Hans Gruber, the villain, the the German villain head dude in this. This is maybe one of the best, coolest, most like meticulous villains we've ever gotten. Like the thing is, he knows exactly. He knows exactly what the FBI is gonna do, and they do exactly what he thinks they're gonna do. I want to see this actor. I think Alan Alan Riches Richesman. I don't know. I want to see this guy play more bad bad guy roles. Like some dude, like quiet guy, like all in black, like some kind of fantastical series. You know what, like, some kind of magical franchise, I could see this guy doing great, doing a great job in that. Before I finish up, I gotta talk about the cop, Carl. Oh, I have a headache. It might be a tumor. It's not a tumor. Carl Winslow, yeah, Carl Winslow, Family Matters, you know that Steve Urkel show? Yeah, he is in Die Hard, and I have a theory, now follow me here, I have a theory that Carl Winslow this is the same universe, like Family Matters and Die Hard in the same universe, like because he says this story about shooting a kid, yeah, that kid was Steve Urkel. Just imagine with me. You know, when you're a rookie, they can teach you everything about being a cop except how to live with a mistake. I shot a kid, shot a kid, shot a kid. Get down, get down, get down. 
He shot Steve. Wild stuff, dudes. But Die Hard. Die Hard is an action-packed 80s movie. One of the best. John McClane, the villain, the action, the tension. This is by far one of the best Christmas movies we've ever gotten. Anyways, my dudes, that's been it. That's my review of Die Hard. And, and the thing is, thank you so, so much for all of the review requests you've been sending in over the year. 1990 has been a great year. Who knows what 1991 is going to bring? Like, maybe, maybe it's going to have another segment. Maybe there's going to be a better segment of JB Classics. Have a great holidays, and remember to greet all of your party guests with a... Welcome to the party, pal! We'll see you later. Hey, <laughs> what's up, boys? Hey, <laughs> what's up, guys? Your boy, J-Buck. Hey, <laughs> what's up, dudes? Hey, <laughs> what's up, dudes? <laughs>